Do not let your keen eyes okay. oh. tonight. Oh, we're in the kennels. There's word of bad men about. All right. Okay. Here's a good boy. Well, we're waiting for these people good to go boy, away. People. Dog, whatever. Um, I'm using a new microphone tonight. Um, I bought. Ooh. I bought a uh, Rode Podcaster USB standalone microphone. Um, it's a studio quality microphone, so it should be a little better quality. Um, yeah, I upgraded a few months ago from a G35 Log Logitech. Please don't come here. Please don't come here. And um, because I was getting fed up with the sound, and I changed to a Sound Blaster Titanium and Sennheiser 360 headphones. Now the headphones are great, but everyone complained about the microphone quality, although I'm suspecting it was also the Sound Blaster. I don't think the Sound Blaster records well. Look at this. Is he just going to patrol up and down here? How am I supposed to get rid of you without killing your dog? Maybe I have to kill the dog. So anyway, yeah, so a lot of people did not like the quality. You're worth a dozen guards, each of you. And I sort of agree with them. I was constantly having to reduce the lower levels because there was a very muddy sound to it. You've still got the taste of that weeper on your tongue, haven't you? <laughs> That's right. Look at those. It's <laughs> a cool laugh. You're a righteous monster for sure. The always find the So yeah, so. Anyway, I bought a new microphone. I'm thinking about buying a new sound card as well. I'm sick of the sound blaster. Game mode versus entertainment mode versus edit mode. God, I'm just gonna go away. Yeah, so anyway, so I don't know how this is gonna sound. I can tell you one thing. I'm really intimidated by this microphone. It's huge and it's sat right in front of my face. It's on this great big extendable arm. Definitely uh, got this whole DJ thing going here. <laughs> okay. Shh. But anyway, yeah, so I won't know what the quality's like until I see it on my video machine. I did some testing on the game machine and it sounded pretty good. But my um, the acid test is how it's going to be when I render the video, I guess. Alright, where are you going? So, there's an, a door or a hallway or something over there. I can see a light. And we do have a room over there. Or a door over there. Is he going to go round or is he going to come back? Now, it's a few people um, have commented on the speed I play this game. And said, oh, you know, you can move a lot faster. You can just go for it. And you'd have made it. And they're probably right. For example, I probably could have got ahead of this guy and made it. I have no idea what's around there. None. And I don't have powers. No, I'm not using blink. I'm not using possess. I would not have known what I was running into. So what I really want to do is wait until he's going... Mind you, I'm a little bothered by the, by the dog. It probably can see me quite far. I'm semi-tempted to shoot the dog and then choke him. See, I was thinking about nipping down then and going round and he turns at that exact moment. This is why you have to learn their routines, you have to learn their habits. Otherwise you can make mistakes. And if you're not willing to reload, making a mistake, well, it's costly. Oh, he's coming back. You know what? I want to check the other door. Next time he goes down there, I think we're going to... He's got very erratic patterns, this guy. Which probably makes him a good guard. It also makes him bloody annoying. Go away. 
Seriously, I'm buying a machine gun. Go away. Okay. So the next question is if I go down here. Lock. All right, let's let's get up high again and see what that guard's doing. Oh God! Not tall enough. Oh, I hate not having the uh, agility perk. Someone else said you're terrible at parkour. Yeah, I was really good when I had the agility perk. Someone else just said you are crap at this game. Yeah, maybe. <coughs> I was a lot better when I was blinking and possessing and you just didn't stop. When you use the power, you just you literally you don't need to stop ever. You just you know, you possess a rat, you get halfway through the building, you come out, you possess a guard, you backstab him. Alright, what's round here? He's not got a dog with him. Him I can choke. Whew. Okay, can he see? I'm a bit worried he's going to turn around and see me. I still haven't quite figured out the exact range they've got. Come on. Come back. Walk this way. I'm going to drop behind you and choke you. There you are. Nice. Are you going for a pee again? Jesus, dude. Lay off the alcohol or something. How many was that? See? Careful. No one discovered. No dogs giving an alarm. A lever. Do not use this lever. It is of the utmost importance that you do not open this cage without my approval. Veracious is ill and quite temperamental. Should his cage be opened, he might attack and endanger anyone patrolling the kennel. That'd be terrible, wouldn't it? There's a broken lever here. Hey, look at that, look at that. Does that open that one? Nice! What did we have in here? Stuff! Oh, money. The Seven Strictures. An excerpt from a commonly distributed overview of seven strictures. Surround your innermost being with these strictures and you will be safe. The seven strictures are our core principles, taught and reinforced by the overseers across the aisles. From these principles stem all matter of rules, social codes and beliefs about the cosmos. One, wandering gaze. Two, lying tongue. Three, restless hands. Four, roving feet. Five, rampant hunger. Six, wanton flesh. And seven, errant, errant mind. All these behaviours must be restricted in order to keep one's heart free from malevolent, malevolent influences. They are the inroads of the outsider. Okie dokie. Go in there. cell and I close the door, is that good enough? Alright, so we've got one guard walking around here. And another one over there. Where did that 
that guy come from? Can I get back up? I don't know, maybe I can. That would be nice. Yes, I can. Nice. So where did you go? There. Alright, what is it with the with that spot? Seriously. The liar. Could you just be a little more hygienic? Bloody hotel going on here. Alright, so we're still looking for clues. Can I get in there somehow? Not sure why I want to, but what was that? That was a gunshot. Oh, do you think he was shooting the dog I let free? Probably. <clears throat> okay, someone's around there. I'll write to her again. She has to see reason. Okay, from the right, from each litter there's usually somewhere shy of four good pups. We always drown the runt. Well, that's not pleasant, is it? Them that remain spend three or so months suckling from their mothers before we start them up with the training. It's, sim it's simple at first, returning sticks and sitting still on command, only pissing outside and the like. Yeah, you know what? You might want to do a little bit of training on your guards, see if you can get them to do that. By the eighth month, we've got them hunting for scented sack dolls hidden in the scrub forest, killing wild pigs on command and taking a man in padded armor down by hanging onto his forearm. At the end of the first year, we graduate ones that learn to sh and shoot the ones that haven't. The overseers take them after that and we never see them again. Except once. Okay, wait a minute. Sorry, well, let me finish this. Walking down Clavering Boulevard, an overseer passed me preaching about litany of the white cliff and the evils of witchery and sure enough his hound started whimpering and wagging its tail that's how I knew it was one of mine whelped up from a pup I don't know four pups but they, say they spent three months suckling and eighth month and, f and first year we yeah do you think what do you think three eight one Okay, I've taken the loot we've gathered and stashed it in the incinerator room. It's under the dead hound, so nobody will dig around and find it. Look to your strictures to figure out the door code. Ah, no, there we go. Lying tongue, wandering gaze, errant mind. Tongue, gaze, mind. Um. Me. Oh, notes. No, it wasn't that one. Tongue. Seven structures. Dong. So two. Gaze. One. Mind. Two on seven. So now I have to try and get back without getting seen again. Run, 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 run. Two on seven. Two on seven. What do you bet? I'm going to run straight into one now. Look out, we've got someone skulking around. Oh, yeah. What? You're kidding me. How, what? How did he... Oh. 
Oh, it... It's the dog I released. Awesome. Yep. Here's the problem with this plan of attack. <laughs> However... What? Oh, and of course there's still more of them in the cages. Well, let's just get them out of sight, just in case. Two, one. Hello. Uh. Oh, no, 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 guys. Meal, meal time. Eat that, eat that. Don't eat me. Mmm, yum, 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 yum. Good God. There's all these bodies in here. What would be your... So this is their stash. Ooh, nice. Well, at least I got my uh, healing thingy back. Alright. Now I have to get out without getting viciously killed by rats. So let's stay up. as long as we can. Rats. Where did they go? Nice. Haha, <laughs> no free meals for you guys. Well, actually, that's a lie. There's tons of them over there. Go on. Off we go. Go away. To main hall. Guys, guys, guys. Go away, go away. To the office of the High Overseer. Awesome. Okay. What have we got? Let's have a look. Holger's eye. Secret passage. This is Campbell's secret chamber. Awesome. The Fugue Feast. At the end of every year, after the last day of the month of songs, we begin the Fugue Feast. A new year has not started, and thus the time that follows is outside the calendar. A period of celebration and feasting begins, during which the people abandon the very practices that keep them whole and healthy over the year. Many leave their homes, euphoric with spirits or potent herbs. High as a kite, you mean. Some paint their faces or wear masks to conceal themselves as they pursue their passions without reservation. When the right cosmological signs are observed, and it is time for the calendar to begin anew, the sitting overseer calls for the hymn of atonement, and the fugue feast ends. Families return to their homes, wives to their husbands, enemies put down their weapons, and fires are extinguished. No complaint is given for those who have wronged others, deviated from ancient codes, or discarded oaths, for this, is, this during the astrological alignment, does not exist and is not recorded. The following day starts the new year. So let me get this right. You can get as high as kite, stab people, shag their wives. Then no one's allowed to say anything the next day. Win. I'm hearing... Oh! Runes. That's what I'm hearing. Runes are kind of creepy, really, aren't they? Mm. 
my girls. I'm not sure how my predecessor operated, but from now on, if one of my girls tries to blackmail you, you send her back to me at the Golden Cat instead of concocting some plan on your own. I've had to replace three girls in as many months, and you can imagine the business of carnal pleasure isn't booming at this place, the plague-stricken hole you call a city, Madam Prudence. <laughs> okay. So... Some of the prostitutes blackmailing. Curse those things. fools at Coldridge for letting Corvo get away. Who knows what the man could do now? High Rebel, Lord Regent, as he asks us to call him now, seems to have faith in all the Sokolov security devices he's put up all over the city, but I'm not so sure. At least the girl has been moved to a safe place. Visiting her twice a week has given me ample opportunity to inspect the facilities, as they say. So Ew. an upside, at least. Oh, I'm gonna enjoy killing that guy. This has climb me written all over it, doesn't it? No idea why. Alright. So, there we go. Stairway. Is anyone coming? Let's. If they do come, let's try and kill them quickly. Do I have? I've only got five of those. Is that another guard there? One guard walked past one on the stairway. Yes, that's a guard. He's moving. All right. Right. Well, we're inside. Now we have to find a way to get past all these uh, guards. 